Okay, now we have a situation where I ran out of power and that's still a thing and I'm going to rely on biofuel for a bit while I get fuel going and that. But the side effect of it was the coal trucks had ran out of coal, the tractors, because the, there wasn't being enough supplied uh, in that time period. So I need to go and visit both of the tractors. Now I could run there or we could unlock the fix it factory cart so this unlocks the schematic that's available in the workshop which is the factory part here so I just need two rotors uh, do I have rotors here uh, yeah I do I do here we go uh, oh perfect Perfect. So we're going to make a cart. And what we're going to do is we'll go up here. Um, and the cart goes into your inventory slot. It has to be in a hand. And you throw it down on the ground. And then you can just, uh, that factory cart actually has a uh, an inventory slot. It doesn't require any fuel, but you can put uh, items in the inventory slot. It, it can actually be automated like the tractors can. But and there you go. So it's very quick, 55. Uh, and I'm just the reason I come here was I wanted to get some coal. And left mouse click puts the horn on and off. Uh, but yeah, it is identical to all other vehicles in the sense that you can, inside the vehicle, you can do the recording and all that stuff. Alright, and the vehicle just ran me over, but that's okay. And now I just need to go to the other one. So, when you leave your cart behind, it'll stay there. But if you want to pick it up again, you have to destroy it and then just go over and and uh, rebuild it where you want to use it. And there you go, that's the factory cart. With the cart, uh, when you open the inventory, you can pick up the golf cart here and it puts it in your inventory as well and you just have to drag it to your hand slot uh, yeah it's not a bad little item to have 